Unfortunately, Madeline suffers from severe combined immunodeficiency, which basically means she can't go out of her house. When she was really young, she had a severe allergic reaction to something in the environment, and her mother, who is a doctor, had her tested and found out that she is basically allergic to everything, and her immune system can't handle normal contaminants in the environment. And so she has been sealed up in her house ever since that point. She interacts basically with two people on a regular basis, her mom, who is a doctor and goes out to work every day, and then her nurse, Carla, uh, who comes in and watches her while her mom is gone. She does all of her schooling online. Um, she doesn't have any real friendships because people have to go through a battery of tests in order to come into the house. And so her contact with the outside world is really limiting. And one of the ways in which she um, kind of views the outside world is through the window in her bedroom. So one day as she's looking out the window, she sees a moving van pull up to the house next door that's been empty for several months and sees a family move in. And there is a boy who's about her age who moves into the bedroom that is directly across from her bedroom. And he notices her. He doesn't He doesn't understand why he doesn't see her in, on the outside at all um, until the, they get to a point where they kind of exchange information um, via their windows. And so thus begins this relationship, this friendship via text and uh, the internet until Madeline decides that she really needs to meet Ollie in person. And the one person who might be willing to do that for her is Carla, her nurse, because she knows her mom would never go for it. So Madeline actually meets up to, with Ollie and um, sparks fly and she wants to see him more. And she starts to make some decisions that um, put her life at risk. So this is Everything, Everything by Nikolai Yoon. It is a romance. It's realistic fiction, um, has some mystery in it as well, um, and an all-around good read.